You see, because what she said is that to go with my interpretation is actually an avoidance from giving it to you. This is very, very beautiful. You see, when we go with our interp. <laughs> <laughs> when we go with our interpretation of something, our belief about something, it is an avoidance, it is not surrender. So surrender means that we don't have any concept of what is, we don't have any interpretation of what is, we don't have a judgment about what is, what is just is. So when we buy our own ideas, then it is not surrendered at the master's feet. You see? Which goes very well with what you were just talking about as well. You see? This is very good. This is the thing about. This is why the pointer is don't believe on a thought. But because in our belief in our thought, we are picking up our individuality. You see? Why do I emphasize on this point so much? It is not because what the thought might be reporting in terms of the appearance is wrong. You see? It is not because of that. It is because what is presumed because of it is that you exist as a separate entity. All thoughts are if entity. The one that needs these thoughts does not actually exist. And any time we go with our own concept and beliefs, interpretations and judgments, then we have shifted away from the surrender position and we have said that this is mine, this thought is mine, it is meaningful to me, never real, it's just a presumed idea.